everybody, it's Tiger Mom from Whatnot. I am gonna just show you how much I love the new CSV mask upload um, for Whatnot. I think it's a great new feature um, and I just wanna show you how I do it and how easy it is. So the first thing you do is go to your profile right here and then you go into seller help and then from seller help you're gonna find the seller tools and it's in beta right now so you go to the CSV uploader and then they have a little link where um, you just click here and you access the template and voila this pops up and all you're going to do is go to file and you're going to just make a copy of it because this is their their basic file and everybody shares it. Um, but the great thing about this also is that it has down in the corner, you have the values. And so this shows you all of the um, categories that you have, your subcategories um, and your basic shipping profiles for when you're listing things. Um, trading cards, sports, toys, comics, all the subcategories that you have here, they are all there for you pre-populated. Um, I would suggest when you do this is that you pay attention to the video, this video that is on the website that you got this form from. Because this will tell you that you have to do um, some precise wording, which is already included in the CSV that I just showed you. So I already downloaded mine. And what I did was pre-populated it. See, the category would be arts and crafts. This is for my sewing patterns um, show. So the subcategory is supplies. And then... I would just enter what I need here. I already pre-populated what I think they would be and the shipping profiles. Um, so I printed out the page and see, as you can see here, I already printed it out. It's already pre-printed. And then all I do is go in here and throw in my chicken scratch. Um, and once I do that, once I type it all in, Back in the form, I'll upload it and I'll show you how that looks. All right, so here you see um, I filled in all of the columns that I needed for the upload and the shipping profile. I um, The great thing is that they've already included all the drop downs, so you can do a buy it now or an auction. And for the shipping profile, um, patterns are about the same as uh, comics, so the four to seven. They have all of them pre-populated, so all you have to do is click that and you're done. So um, the price right here, you would enter a price if you're going to be doing a buy it now. So say I had a pattern and I want to do buy it now, you would just enter whatever um that you wanted as the price and that would load in your upload so i'm just going to change it back to auction and it's going to be saved as a csv all right so now we're going to go ahead and just save it do 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 And then we're going to go back into the, um, go, you're going to go back into your whatnot and ooh, let me see, where are my shows? Here's my show. Here it is. So you're going to open the stream and down here, you're going to add and you're going to just do a quick add and right there, you see the upload CSV, bam, upload and go get that file sewing patterns and that's it 
and then just click yes to the products that you're uploading. Alrighty, upload complete. And that's it. And then you're gonna see the files, all of your products that you just uploaded. And there you go. These are all my new products. I'm so happy that this exists. It makes things so much easier. Um, the only thing that is because it's in the beta stage right now is that I can't add photos. You, it's, you can't add photos at the same time you add all the text. So what I have to do is now that all of the text is in there, I'll just go back in to the um, to edit. And unfortunately, you can't. We cannot enter any photos into um, the listing through the computer. So what you have to do is go back on your phone and then insert the photos um, at that point from your phone. So yeah, that's it. It's a great new feature that they have and I'm sure they're gonna add a add photo option eventually. I hope they do. All right, that's all for me for now. Bye.